Welcome back, everyone. I think this is part four of Adrift. Hanging out with our nice little cherry blossom tree. Very nice of them to throw this in there for, uh... You know, it's like, you guys ever play The Sims? And there was that one meter called Room, where if you were in a nicely decorated room, it just put your Sim into a better mood. I feel like that's very much like how it is in the real world. And I can imagine that if I was stuck in this space station for however long, um, I would start to miss little decorations and things like that. Though admittedly, this is a pretty cool space station. I kind of dig the general design of it. But things like uh, trees and plants and other little decorations do make a difference, I think, in your overall well-being and mood. Bap! Solid. All right, we're good on oxygen in case we need to come back through here. Oh, audio log. Nice. More McDonough. Man, I want something from someone else besides McDonough. Okay. So I think I'm going the right way here. Lucy has moved on from resentment to indifference in our weekly good comes. Oh, no. It's been weeks since she sent the new piano piece. The transfer news barely registered with her. Oh, that's not his daughter, it's his wife. This is a pattern for me. I thought she'd at least be happy to hear I'm coming home. But I've disappointed her too many times to count at this point. I've done some real damage to her. To us. By being part of this mission. Oh, it's so sad. I'm surprised by um, how well acted the uh, voice logs seem to be. At least his. I mean, he's the only one we've heard so far, but that really sounds like genuine concern. We got another one. Yup. More McDonough. System specialist, McDonough. Okay, well, I wish we had some more oxygen before we make this trek. But uh, you know what? Here we go. Oh. Caused a massive power Whoa! <gasps> Spacewalk replacing solar stations. Guys! Station dark. Comes out for 23 of the longest minutes of my life. I thought this is it. Try We're trying not to interrupt his thing. DVD so I could at least hear Lucy on the way out, but couldn't grab signal. Floating there in silence, waiting for the end. I really saw how selfish I've been with her. I have to change. Whoa. I'm sorry about that, buddy, but oh my god, look, it's nighttime down on the earth. Oh, that is just phenomenal. All right, so here's our ultimate goal. We're going there. That's where I think we should be going. Um, I think that's where our next objective is going to be. Uh, I'm floating down towards here so I can nab some oxygen along the way, because otherwise I will not make it. Holy crap, is that where I just came from right now? Oh, I guess it is. Huh. Yeah, there's our tree. Maybe this was not the most efficient way to get there, but... Scenic, at the very least. I wish I could figure out where these locations are. Alright, we're slowly making progress. I hope I get a speed upgrade as the next one. That would be nice. I'm gonna itch my nose. Ah. Where's the desk? Alright, there we go. It's hard to make sure I'm still facing the right way for the camera and the microphone. Alright, here we go. The problem with being out in space like this is that it drains my stuff at a higher rate. Um, I'm hoping- oh, I keep forgetting about that scan thing that I have. So far I haven't really needed it. Well, we're gonna be cutting it close here. I don't see any oxygen tanks immediately available. I bet you there will be one right on the inside if we can make it. Our oxygen's doing okay. Alright, let's go. I better be able to get in there or else I'm shit out of luck. Alright, let's see what we got. Oh, I can feel my heart beating, or I can hear it, rather. Please be accessible. Oh, thank god. Oh shit, but there's no oxygen immediately right here. Alright, I'm gonna get that inertia. Oh, whoa, suddenly a bunch of- th Ah! Things spawned. Okay, we're cutting it close here. There better be some oxygen right on the other side of this door. Come on. Uh, leak reduced. Nice. Well, at least we're not hemorrhaging oxygen anymore. Here we go. Ah. Oh, you know what that is? I think that's just telling me that those little, um, those must be little hard drives that I'm picking up. I don't know what they're good for, but I've got a little notification on the inside of my helmet telling me when they're here. Um, can we get some oxygen, please? Shit. 
Ah ha ha, thank god. Let's get two if we can. Um, is there another one? Hello? Fuck, really? Is that it? Is it inside? Boom. Nope, doesn't look like it. Damn, I really smacked the shit out of that thing. Was that one of the terminals? Can't tell. Nope. Fuck it. Alright, let's keep moving. We're okay for now. Ah! Get out of my face. Oh, is that one? No, it's the one I just depleted. Shit, okay. I gotta go back outside. Um, watch out for those cables. Those drain our oxygen pretty fast. I think. Last time I got struck by a couple of them was in the beginning of the game, but I definitely don't want to repeat that. If I can help it. What? 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 Is that guy talking about having sex with a crew member It made him want to use, like, drugs? Okay, we gotta get to this oxygen bit on the other side. Okay, this is dead. Whoa, I just... Okay, fuck. Okay, so we came from there. Let's remember that. So we need to go there or there. Here we got some oxygen. Oh. Here we are. Wow, that, that's... Whenever it moves you by itself like that, it's very disorienting because it creates like a disconnect between what your body is doing. I mean, it's kind of weird enough when you play one of these Oculus games where like you have to move with a control stick um, and you like actually, you know, because you're not walking. That's what creates the disconnect. So your body starts moving and you don't move in physical space. That's why the vibe is cool. But with this one, it's actually kind of okay because um, I'm moving using thrusters, so it makes sense that my body wouldn't be moving. Okay, I think... Is that the one I'm looking for? I'm, I need to orient myself to see where the thing that I was looking for was. There it is. Alright, cool. Alright, we are on the right track here, I think. Oh my god! What the hell is going on there? Whoa! Whoa! Uh, O2 leak at hazardous levels. Okay, so we gotta be really careful here. Yeah, no kidding. Alright, we got this, no problem. Oh, we can't get close to there either. Jesus, okay. Here we go, you guys ready? Here we go. Oh! Oh! Don't get too close. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Oh! Oh! Oh, Jesus! What happened? Am I good? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Am I dead? No. I think that got me. Oh, I thought we were totally fine. I think I'm dead. <laughs> All right, let's try that one more time. Okay. Um, so we can orient ourselves using this thing. So I went through there, right? So I think that's where I should go again. But this time we'll search around for an alternate entrance. Because that uh, obviously did not work out too hot. Yes. Man, can I just like hold on to this but like not use it? That would be nice. Okay. Um, yeah, I copy. There's no sweat. Okay, so I need to get in. I can't do it that way. But that's definitely where we need to go. So maybe they want me to go around this way. Um, it's okay. Lots of oxygen around here. That's nice at least. I'm gonna grab this bottle on the way. Please don't smack that bottle, I want it. Oh, it's gonna hit it. Oh, nope, don't, 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 I need that. Oh, it just goes right through it. That's kind of disappointing. Whoa. Oh, where'd it go? What the hell? <laughs> All right, fine, I'll just grab this one then. Okay, so there's our, we can't go through there. Looks like it connects over here. Ow, shit. Oh, great, we just knocked that thing right into where we need to go. Fantastic. Alright, well hopefully it bounces- Oh, it's gonna bounce back towards us though, that's not good. Alright. I find myself like twisting my head. It's kinda odd. Whoa. Nice and easy. Got another audio log here. 
Who we got? McDonna. Systems specialist. McDonna. Andrew. Two. Okay, so yeah, we can move through here. How's my oxygen doing? About half a tank. Hey, Lucy's recital. Oh, I missed. Beautiful. I think that's uh, Justin Bieber's new album. Let me grab this boy. Oh, God. Okay, well, that side's not electric, I don't think. Sweet. Yeah, alright, this is looking like how we gotta do it. Can I connect down here? Go on in. Let's see. Oxygen's fine, I gotta- Oh, seriously? Oh, it might knock me into the other one. Oh, hold on, take it easy. Man, the range. How is it electrocuting such a large field? We're in space, there aren't even any particles for it to electrocute. Um... Fuck, seriously? Okay, well at least I'm gonna get some oxygen, but I can't get through here apparently. It's gonna make me go all the way around. Oh, look at that shadow. It's really detailed. Gotcha. Wow. This is just, honestly, I'm gonna show so many people this game, they're gonna just flip out. Um, this Oculus was probably one of the best purchases we made just for parties. It's so much fun to like have people come over and try it out who have never tried it before. It's one of my favorite things to do is just watch people react to the Oculus who I mean, either have heard of it or have never used it or have not heard of it at all. It's even more fun. Wow. Alright, let's keep going. In fact, you know what? Actually, I'm gonna grab that oxygen. I'm really starting to get the hang of the movement. It feels a lot more natural. Like I, ouch, god damn it. <laughs> Guess I shouldn't uh, count my chickens before they hatch. Knock on wood and all that. All right, let's keep moving. Oh. Smack. I love all these little plant units. I wonder what they're all about. Because, I mean, these are obviously being grown for a purpose. These are not just decorations. They have these kind of weird self-contained pods. Maybe they're like... EVA critically damaged. Yeah, I know that. EVA systems operating at 64%. Yep. And for EVA emergency repair required. Yep. Um, okay. Well, I think that where we want to go is off to the left over there. Um, we can redo our oxygen here. Let's just go ahead and check and see what's over here, just real fast. Exit online, we know that. Um, mm, I feel like there's gonna be a terminal in this room. Anything? Anything? Oh, one of these deals. Are these- do these repair me? I don't understand. Yeah, oh cool, do I get an upgrade? What's gonna happen? Whoa. I feel like Samus. Oh man, could you imagine a Metroid Prime game in the Oculus? That would be so sick. All right, what's happening? Please remain still. So, oh, so that's like the rate at which my oxygen depletes. Nice. Cool. So it's not like a permanent upgrade. I think it's just like heals my, uh, What's it called? Helmet. I almost went like this, but you guys can't see the helmet from the face cam. It really feels like you should be able to, and that's like a definite, uh, what's it called? Um, triumph on the part of the developers for making this feel so seamless. What's really interesting is like, so right, like right now I'm focused, my eyes focused on that door. Um, but like, so I'll have to turn and look in my helmet and like look at the, you know, the information on the HUD that's right there. But so it's interesting how your eye can actually focus on these like different, you know, points of depth when the whole thing is fake. It's none of it's real. There's not any actual difference between, you know, the distance, but that just goes to show you how the Oculus really evolves that sense of presence. Bounce. Interesting how those things don't set off the motion detector. Oh wait, fuck, seriously? That's where I need to go still, isn't it? How am I supposed to... I don't think I can do this, man. I need to like... I can't like fit through there. I don't think. 
Or maybe I can. Because that one doesn't look like it's all... That one looks like it's electrocuting all over the place. Does this one? I can't really tell. Should we go for it? I don't know. Right, I'm gonna try. Wish me luck. Oh. Oh yeah, baby. Whew! I was gonna say, there's like no other way in. So this is definitely where we're supposed to be going. Hence all these obstacles. Yep, there's where we wanna go. And that connects to where we're going now, right? I hope. Oh shit. Um, you already know the status of my crew, dog. Or maybe they don't have access to that, like, remote deal. Okay, so we can still make it through. Well, if we can make it through that one, then maybe we could have made it through the other one. Hopefully there's a way to connect. So we definitely have to use that node, not the one over there, but this one. Here we go. Here we go. Gotta be very careful. Whew! Nice. Alright, so I think that thing is over to our left. It's so easy to get turned around. We're like upside down right now. Ouch. Keep it going. Keep it going and get some oxygen. Why not? How are we doing on time? I don't really know, I can't tell. Whoa, all right then. So that means now I gotta go, so I just came through there. I gotta go back to the right, I think. Nice, got some dank oxygen. Let's get moving over here, right? Yep, here we go. What was that? Oh, hello. Gotcha, solid state drive. Am I going the right way? I really can't tell. Well, okay, hold on a sec. Whoa, is that the atmosphere? That's cool. Um, oh, hello. Well, shit, where, is that it down there? Where did it go? Ah, reset, there we go. Okay, I gotta get oriented here. Where is my, there it is. Okay, it looks like there's really no way to get in there from anything that I'm connected to right here. I just have to get in to that. How oh, much my oxygen? Not great. I just gotta get in through the way that. Oh, I'm so confused. I just came through here, right? Actually, you know what? This is bad. We don't want to go that way. Um. All right, shit. We need to go back in. I'm gonna run out of oxygen. But try and go that way. Nom. All right, so now I'm oriented properly. Give you a like reduce. Yeah, you can see, I don't know if these are cracks or if that's just frost that starts to develop on my, ow, helmet. So I'm gonna go to the left over here because I came from over there. Ha, <laughs> hello. My oxygen buddy just floating with me. Wow. Maybe we can get in this way, I really don't know. Did we just come through here? Oh my god, fine. This is very disorient. I mean, it looks like we can kind of circle around. It looks like this is just where we came th through right now. You know what? Maybe we could have made it. I'm just going to go straight over there. Because if we can make it through these ones, I'm willing to bet we can make it through that other one. I just need to float out here. Where is my target here? That's not it. There it is. Or where's the closest open? It's across this way. So if I can get in there, I mean, we're good to go. You know what? I'm going to free float across, and we're going to do that next time on Belmont Boy. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. <laughs>